stuff, either for you or against you. The other thing you got to think about is keeping a scorecard. I mean, think about the NBA. They keep a score. And some of you don't even know what the score is happening in your organization because you've not kept the score. On our team, we have something called the activity tracker, which means every day you end up with points. Some people end up with 10 points. Some people like Jackie Underwood consistently every day get 100 points, right? And if you don't have something you're measuring in your system every day, in order for you to take your business to the next, the next level, you got to keep a scorecard. You also got to think about your goals. See, they say that people who are unsuccessful don't write their goals down. They carry their goals around in their head like marbles, wrapping around the case. See, if you don't have your goals written down, it's like trying to shoot a gun with no bullets. You're shooting blanks every day. And then you got to think about your habits. In fact, let's study some people with championship habits. Larry Legend, Larry Bird. This is someone who knew how to create championship habits. He wasn't the most talented, not the most athletically gifted, but what did he have that no one else would do? He had a relentless dedication to his success. Every morning before school, he would go out and take 500 practice shots every single morning. And because of that dedication, folks, when he got to the NBA, he led the Boston Celtics to three championship titles. How powerful is that? How powerful. See, you can make up what you lack in innate ability with hard work, with dedication, with perseverance. And then you got to go into your chapter, your second quarter, right? Thinking about this. See, every great team has team players who own 100%. See, if you're the type of person who always plays the game, blame game, you're never going to succeed. Do you think that Michael Jordan would have ever blamed Scottie Pippen? See, as a champion player, you always have to own 100%. The other thing you got to do is realize that time is of the end. The clock is already started. Did you hear Jamon talk about there was a lady on his team who put 18 people in over the last week? Yeah. I mean, 